about um, quarter past eight Sunday morning in sunny Saigon and uh, not so many people here and this is an area I was actually literally dragged away from yesterday by a couple of guys overseeing this renovation of sorts taking place up there obviously they were worried about uh, debris falling on uh, passers-by they didn't have a, an exclusion zone made out so instead they just dragged, pushed people away from it as you walk nearby and of course they couldn't explain it to me in the language because uh, I don't speak Vietnamese so, so there you go now the subject I'm getting such an early start today for the basic reason I want to get to the supermarket the, the co-op before it gets too crowded it's supposed to open at about 8 o'clock according to Google we'll see if that's accurate or not and I'm feeling a little more human today throat's still a little husky but it might be okay to do the bars tonight, so there we go. I'll be spending another diet indoors and had a, had enough of the apartment. So we'll see, but if it's just Sunday morning, still got a bit of traffic here, but this is nothing compared to later. And it's gonna be brutal as usual. Oh, they're already walking. <laughs> yeah, they're, well they're right. He uh has got a six cents compared to me. It's uh Yeah, it's, uh, it's a bit quieter right now, and of course it's a little cooler, so it's quite a pleasant time to have a walk. And, uh, but it'll get more insane as the day goes on, although not as insane, it is Sunday. And my major concern today will be finding where I can buy some food. I think the photo place will be open. There'll be something, but I don't think the, uh, the big place, the big... Uh, takeaway place uh, that I've been going to recently which is just because I've been feeling a bit crook I just thought I'm not going to go all the way to uh, to where Stanley is it's another that's a, that's a, it's about twice the distance so I thought no bugger that I'll uh, make a shorter distance and to this, this local place which is which is quite good actually the, the quality of the food is excellent it's cheap it cost me 70,000 dong for about three different courses actually the the, uh, the sort of the the egg uh, portion of the course was gigantic. I mean, they got these big rounds of of, um, of like scrambled egg or you know uh, um, like an omelette. I guess it's the French type of influence of spicy omelette. I got about half of the bloody thing. It was huge. And that was one, only one course. I got plenty of pork and greens and uh, and of course the uh, spinach soup is a very healthy spread of food actually um, so I, I'm happy to go, go to that place to get my uh, lunch at the moment because I mean I'll be closer to uh, Stanley's next week when I do my last week here and I'll be at my new apartment and we'll see how we go but, uh, <laughs> No, no taxi guys, always looking for a fare. <laughs> always. Don't know if you saw the guy with his hand up there on the bike. But that's just, uh, they're always about. There's a million of them. I don't think they make much money. Anyway, it's uh, still a few people out and about on Sunday morning. There's just so many people here. Anyway, I'll... Uh, I doubt whether the, uh, the photocopying ones are doing much trade right now, but who knows, it could be open. The Sunday generally is a bit quieter though. Definitely uh, food-wise you don't have as many choices. Well, certainly the construction industry is working. I can hear the uh, sounds coming from that site. So uh, it's probably a seven-a-day-a-week job that. But uh, it's quite a nice place there. I don't know what that is. But quite an attractive area it's weird contrast this city got some very attractive buildings but gee the pavement's sort of uneven it's uh, I walked down Pasteur yesterday and it was absolutely shocking down uh, down this section of Pasteur which is a bit further north uh, so you see that you see some parts are just rubble other parts are properly paved 
it's just hit and miss. So you've got to have your wits about you when you're walking. Uh, I feel a little more... The traffic's already building up, it's only uh, 20 past 8. Yeah, and I had... Yeah, the bang me I had yesterday was alright. Those guys are wearing, uh, they've got, they've got, uh, these guys have their uni have got uniforms on, but they're not cops. Cops have got a sort of like a bright green uniform. Those ones had a, a sort of a, a fawny colour. So, I think that might denote that they're traffic cops. Not that there's that many of them around. Not many cops of any description are in. Now all the photocopy places are open. They're all doing business at 8 o'clock on Sunday as well. So there you go, there's Commerce for you in Saigon. Girly mags. <laughs> uh, Asian girly mags. Just notice them. I miss a hell of a lot here. It's pathetic. Yeah, like I said, it's, it's a feast for the senses, this place. Yeah, it's an amazing city.